Okay, what's going on here? Ah, I'm streaming my iPad to my PC. It's been done before, but there's a screen recording of it as well. And what makes this even more interesting is I can do all this without jailbreak and most importantly, for free. And this is how to do it. So you want to point your browser on your computer to www.lonelyscreen.com and this enables you to download an AirPlay receiver for your PC or Mac, but obviously Mac can do it with QuickTime anyway. So this is more important for PC users. When you click on download to Windows, it will download a program, which then downloads two more programs which actually installs the software. I'm not sure why it does that, but anyway, that should get you to this screen after all the installation is done. Now we need to stream the iOS device to your PC, and that's easily done just like any other iOS screen recorder, in that you swipe up to get the control center, tap on AirPlay mirroring, and there should be an AirPlay option for Lonely Screen. Tap on that, and then it should replicate your iOS screen onto your computer. And it really is as simple as that. As you can see from my taps and swipes, there is a fraction of lag, but nothing that's going to concern you too much when you do your screen recordings. And in order to do that, you need to click on the red button at the bottom of the Lonely Screen program on your PC. Now, this is where things get very interesting and very exciting for screen recorders like us. That's right folks, not only does it output the sound, but it records it as well, and only the sounds from your iOS device, so it doesn't pick up background noise such as your voice. Now, in this screen recording of VGJ Felix absolutely destroying somebody at Clash Royale, that's me by the way, there was a little bit of stutter when the recording started, but generally it was very good. Now in terms of recording options, they're absolutely non-existent. You can't change the frame rate, the quality, the audio recording, anything. It just records as is. But here are the file properties from the end recording. For this portrait screen recording, it's recorded at 720p quality at 25 frames a second. And this one and a half minute video was 63 meg in size. It will record in either portrait or landscape. Just make sure to set the orientation on your device before you press record on your lonely screen program program on the PC. And yep, this fella is in a bit of trouble. So much so that he seems to have left the game. Now at the top of this video I said that Lonely Screen is free and as far as I'm aware I can't see any caps on recording so this looks like a completely free piece of software. Now after you stop the recording by pressing the stop button on the Lonely Screen program you also want to swipe up on the control center, tap on the Lonely Screen mirroring and turn it off to stop the streaming to your PC. Judging by Lonely Screen's Facebook page this hasn't been touched for six months and it still works so hopefully it will continue to work without any cost being associated with it. So my advice is download this now and give it a try as soon as possible. So if you've got a PC, this looks like the perfect solution. If you've got any more questions, pop them in the comments below. Otherwise, subscribe to the Video Gadgets channel for more iOS screen recording content. Enjoy the rest of your tech day. Bye for now.